things happen quickly in hockey and not reacting correctly to them or missing them entirely can lead to some unfair outcomes. Here we have a Belgian player in possession of the ball. He's tackled, he regains possession of the ball as the Australian player loses control of it. The Australian player then bumps into the back of him. The umpire has a clear view of this but doesn't react to it. As a result, the Belgian player loses possession of the ball. He then makes an attackal attempt on the Australian player who's just dispossessed him and he probably makes a stick contact which the umpire has absolutely no chance at all of seeing but probably heard. A case where we need more officials on the pitch. The ball is gone. There's no need for the Australian player to react in any way to the previous stick contact or what is occurring now, but he waves his stick above his head to demonstrate that he is, has been impeded. He ought to be penalised for that, it's dangerous play. Anyway, play goes on and the ball is brought back to near to the top of the circle where the initial stick contact by the Belgian player took place. Here we have another little bump. The initial bump was missed by the umpire or ignored and it led to a ripple magnified effect. There is he leaning onto the attacker to prevent him getting to the ball. The attacker manages to get round the defender but thrown off balance in his attempt to do so. There is then a back stick apparently by the second Australian player there which was missed unsurprisingly. Third Australian player takes possession of the ball back to the first player who then proceeds to shield the ball and shunt with it out of the area of the circle and towards the sideline. That should have been penalised with a penalty corner. It's a deliberate obstruction. then we get a mess. I don't know what happens here. It looks as if the Belgian player ends up touching the ball with the wrong side of his stick, the side not above the face. Possibly makes a foot contact, I don't know. The Australian players bring the ball in fairly typical that way. Uh, well away from sideline where the free hit needs to be taken and because this is a very good umpire he insists that the free ball is taken in the right place.